So that's a lateral view, so you can see it's a proximal fixating stem, quite a long rod intramedullary, and the fracture is a lot, sort of a short spiral fracture with maybe some comminution here at this area, but I think the two main fragments maybe is attached to the proximal fragment distally, and here is long sp this sp short spiral fracture at the distal fragment. So when we come to um, surgery, I think we always have to classify the fracture itself. I think I use, or we use the unified classification system. So UCS, then the hip joint is the four joint, shoulder is one, elbow is two, wrist is three, four is the hip joint, so it's a number four. The femur in the classification is the number three, 4.3, and then the fracture is somewhere around the bed of the prosthesis, so it's a type B. The question is always if you deal with proximal femur fractures, or, uh, fractures around the prosthesis, is it a B1 or maybe B2 or B, maybe B3? To answer this question, we published once this algorithm. It's free um, to download. And I think the first question, what you have to ask um, yourself or the patient, did the patient have any previous type pain? 